What's up, everybody? Uh, this is, uh, I guess you could say it's Cali Katana. My wife, she's out of town for the weekend, so I am free to do whatever I want. And so what I want to do is go for a little ride. Well, I wanted to make a video because I'm going to take a trip real quick to uh, get my hair cut and stuff. But um, I want to take a ride and just kind of talk a little bit about some stuff. Uh, like uh, not um, buckling my helmet, which I should do. I will do this in a minute when I stop. But, um, whew, man, we've been having like the worst weather the last couple of days. Nothing but rain and just we had hail. It was just crazy, y'all. Just crazy hail, crazy weather. But um, hopefully now I see the sun trying to peek out a little bit. It's a little cool. So I decided to take the gold wing today. And it's a lot windy. Man, it's windy. And, um, whoo. But uh, I decided to take the gold wing today just to get out and get some fresh air and things. So um, I got a couple of topics I want to talk about. But I guess I will start that once I've uh, gone to the store real quick. Got to get some cash out. Oh, okay, there you go. Good job. And I'm going to turn here and take it slowly, 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 slowly. Is it raining already? Really? It better not rain. I'll be pissed if it starts raining. I'll be so upset, y'all. Very upset if it starts raining. Oh my god! Oh! 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 <laughs> Oh, I've been abused. You saw that, right? I'm hurt. I'm suing for a hundred thousand dollars. I know. I told you I had two of them. Oh my God, my better. Really? You're me Yeah, I can't believe you hit me. I can't, you know, you know, and I got you on camera, so I can sue now. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, you did. Yeah, you did. Yeah, you hit me. And then things she just starts hitting me, so I, I see. I'm hurt. I'm gonna tell you, manager, I'm, my chest pains. I'm, I'm having a heart attack now. Oh, hurt me so bad. Why'd you do that to me? You promise you won't hit me again? Are you gonna be my friend? How do I scare you? Because well, I turned around, you were right there. I went to say hi. <laughs> I mean, you know who I am by now. Many times I come in here. I thought we had a relationship, but now I see how it's going to be. You're just going to beat me up every time you see me. That was only one time. Well, it th takes one time to get beat. <laughs> uh, I'll see you later, hopefully, if I'm not in the hospital. All right, what's up, everybody? Back again. Oh, man, this, this helmet cover is very, how can I say, this head cover is like, gets so much attention, which is kind of cool, but man, I didn't know I was going to get beat, I didn't know I was going to get beat like that, but you know, it's all fun and games, oh man, you know the craziest thing guys is this, you know, I normally ride a sport bike, and um, I end up um, getting this gold wing, which was a really good deal and I was riding it and you know the thing about this Gold Wings is like it's very big and awkward and everything so it's kind of hard to ride sometimes so I decided to put a Voyager trike kit on it because um, I, I, I feel bad that when I go riding with my wife because my wife rides that my daughter gets left behind because I don't feel safe with her on the back of the Ninja and things like that and I want her to be safe so you know I just wonder that you know, I, I wanted her to feel left you know not left out so I put a tri kit on this bike which a lot of people think I'm stupid a lot of people are like oh my god I can't believe you got a cruiser blah, blah, blah. but you know what forget them it's like I care about my daughter and I want my daughter to do the things I do and be involved in my life 
And I just don't want to, you know, I know a lot of people in the bike world, friends who are married or who have kids, and the first thing you want to do is when they when an event happens or something goes on, they throw their kids to the, like their parents' house or a friend's house and just like be babysitters all the time and not like spend time with the kids and have, you know, have them be with them when they do certain things and things like that. So I was not going to be that kind of father where I just throw my kids to whoever just so I could go riding, you know. I want to share that. Even though it's not my typical ride, I love having her with me. And it was just, you know, we took a ride the other day. It was really nice and it was really fun. And we had like a lot of good bonding time. But, you know, I just want to tell you guys is that I'm going to start trying to make more videos and things like that and try to get more out there. There's a lot of people who don't like my videos. I've had a lot of bad comments so far. But, you know, I'm not perfect at this. I'm learning. You know, I'm not like Chase and all those people and Snooge and, you know, 6-4 Honda. I mean, they have all started from somewhere. I bet you if they look, if you look at their videos in the beginning, I bet you they weren't as good as they are now. So, I'm just starting to lower the totem pole. So, I'm still going to keep doing what I do. And if you don't like it, then just don't subscribe and watch. That's how I feel. Um, but I'm this summer, I'm really going to be out in the streets. I'm really going to be out seeing different things. I'm going to be using my drone to take videos and stuff like that and go to bike functions and stuff. I'm really going to be out there and put my face out there and just have fun, you know, because it's all about having fun and meeting people and just getting out there. Um, the thing is, is like, I see a lot of people who vlog and stuff like that, a lot of vloggers and motor vloggers and stuff like that. And, you know, I really love talking about motorcycles. I really like being around the lifestyle of motorcycles. No, I don't have the money to go buy the new news like a lot of people do. But, you know what, who cares if you have a new bike or old bike or sometimes even no bike. It's about the passions you have for motorcycles and the people around there so you know i suggest you know that if you're going to get a bike this summer you know get what you that you feel comfortable don't get what people tell you to get i mean you can always look on youtube and find somebody with a channel with a video to tell you what kind of bike you should get and things like that you know get what you get what you think you feel good with you know i bought my wife her first bike was a 750 her first bike is and still has a 750 katana you know yeah katana's not the best bikes in the world they're good starter bikes but but, you know, people are like, oh, you should give her a 250, 300. No, I think my wife deserved a bigger, faster, better bike. And she loves that bike. She won't get that bike up for nothing. I mean, I would like to get her a ZX-12. But, you know, she is just not into, like, the... I mean, she's into bike life, but she's not, like, all into, oh, I got to get the... I, I got to get I gotta get the new thing, the best thing, things like that. So, you know, it's just a lot, you know, that... Oh, it, windy. But it's just a lot. And, you know, when I got this bike, this Gullwing I'm on, you know, it's it's really big. I'll tell you that. It is really, really big. But I wish I had the money to make this a full trike kit instead of just a Voyager kit. Because turning this thing is so awkward and so heavy. But I don't know if that's me that's scared of it because the thing about it is it sits on two little two the, the 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 wheels are on its side and the wheels on its side and it um and they have their own suspension so so it has its own suspension so it sits like this and the bike and my bike's in the middle and what it does is my bike back tire is when it turns the bike and I mean like pushes the bike and drives the bike now the side it's like a basic glorified training wheel but the thing is it gives so I can lean the bike over and my wheel stay straight crazy isn't it and it just takes the time to get used to it and you know it just takes the time to get used to it but I don't know guys it's really hard to get used to something when you're so used to doing something else but at the end of the day, the reason why I did it is why is because I wanted to do it and I felt like I needed to do it for my daughter and my family. So that's I think that's important enough. Um, eventually, I'm gonna get you know get it painted and stuff like that. Hopefully, one day I can afford a full converted trike. I mean, the thing about it is, guys, is this: I spent this is a '96 Gold Wing that has 133,000 miles. So if you know anything about Gold Wings, 133,000 miles is still like almost breaking it in um i got on a really good deal 
and I only paid like twelve hundred dollars for this bike and it was like it was a good deal I mean it, I had to fix it I had to, the fuel pump was out in it but I fixed that and it started up and they've been good since so I did a full maintenance on it like oil change radiator flush you know brake fluid change brake everything on this bike and I was I was riding it and trying to ride with people I felt really uncomfortable about it because I didn't want to like fall over and it was so heavy and all those plastics and things like that and so, you know, I've been doing a lot of researching and researching and researching, and I finally found a Voyager trike kit that goes that would go for this bike. But those things are like almost four thousand dollars. I mean, seriously, four thousand dollars just for an A-frame with two wheels on the side. Crazy, isn't it? I thought so too. But I mean, you gotta pay. That's what you gotta pay. And there's not really anything else I could do unless I made a homemade one or 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 had someone fabricate one, which I wasn't gonna do. So. I just kept, I just, I've learned this, guys. Whenever you want something, and you have, sometimes, I mean, there's some things, if you want it so bad, you get it, but sometimes you, you just got to be patient and just let it come to you. I've always learned that if you want to get something and you, and you don't, and you can't get it right now, just be patient. Don't put yourself in a bad bind trying to get something. Just let it come to you. And eventually, I swear to you, it will come to you. And I was going to pay $4,000 for a trike kit for this bike. That's like insane almost. But I just waited and waited and waited and just kept looking and just, you know, I'm not going to say I looked every day and I just like, you know, just looked every day. I just kind of kept my eyes open. And eventually, one popped up in Tennessee and they only wanted a thousand dollars the best offer so we t we talked on the phone negotiated down to 900 so I spent 900 dollars and went and got it and um, yeah I spent 900 dollars and went and got it and um, oh that's rain okay um, I went 900 dollars and got it and brought it home and things like that now the thing about it is like the trike kit, the trike would fit my bike, but the kit that the bike came with does not fit my bike. The harness, the actual, the actual A-frame will fit my bike, but the harness that hooks to the bike, that hooks to the frame, was not going to fit my bike. So I had to buy the, the, the harness that fixed this bike to put this trike kit on it. And that right there costs me $750. Wow, yes, I know. But the thing But the thing about it But the thing about it is that I've already done got this far and it would be stupid to stop myself over seven hundred fifty dollars. You know, because at the end of the day I'm still saving money. You know, at the end I'm still saving the money. So that's why I was okay with um spending the seven hundred and fifty dollars. Um, spending the seven hundred fifty dollars. Thank you, sir. Hey. So now I am happy that I got it on there, and everything seems to be working fine with it so far. Just it's just gonna take me some time to get used to it. I just hope it doesn't rain. I mean, it's, uh, the weather looked decent, so hopefully it's, it's not gonna be too bad on the weather on me.